Daniel songs for Siba and um and I'm stuck and I'm lost <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah I don't know where I'm going but um I started my business I started songs for Siba and um 13 years ago in downtown Louisville Kentucky selling out of my backpack I I have a daughter named Siba and and she lives in Atlanta with her mom and I would miss her I would send her little poems father to daughter poems and um and next thing you know, people will see me making those little cards and, and ask me to make one for the for the loved ones, for their for their kids, for birthdays or what have you. And and thus started the songs for Siba copyright business. And um, Cafe Kilimanjaro. It was an African restaurant on Fourth Street, and they called me in to um, to clean up for them. And, and in the process of that, I got my business license and sat in front of the cafe with two tables. And um, a year later, they had a shop adjacent to the cafe and it was vacant and I, they gave me a shot at it and I was in the shop for nine years. And, um, but I started by selling painted t-shirts and, and my original paintings out of my backpack. And, and now I'm in the Highlands, 13 years later. I have a house in the Highlands that I sell out of and, and I do, I do my poems, I put them on wood, I put them on canvas boards, and I still paint the original t-shirts. And But I also incorporate other things in my work. I sell the natural body oils, I sell the natural incense, I carry the natural African shea butter, the shea butters and the soaps, and, and African jewelry that I make and I carry from different parts of Africa, mostly Ghana and Senegal. And um, and this is what I do, man. But to let people know that anything that they pursue for themselves in life can materialize as long as they're willing to stick with it and work with it. And um, and that's what I decided to do. I and I do it one day at a time. And, and life is energy, you know. I, an old man told me a while back. He says that we are spiritual beings on a human journey. And, and one thing that I've learned is that the energy that I create is, is positive or negative, is what that I carry and I give to the world. So I decided that I'm gonna give something positive to life and to the world. And, um, and that's what I do. I, the energy within my poems and within my, my original art pieces and my painted t-shirts is meant for one particular person. And um, I, I could go to the extent of mass producing, but then that would take away the originality of what I do. And so I, I prefer that everybody who, who enters my life and, and purchase something, and um, it was meant for them. And, um, and that's it. Yeah. Shabbat.